Hello everybody and welcome. Today we are playing Lou Mini, a game which has recently been released as a pre-alpha demo, which is an absolutely fantastic game. Basically you play as this guy here, you collect up these little orbs and stuff and you explore and have a good time effectively. It's a puzzle game, but it's a puzzle game that I like, so you can take that as a win. Uh, it's really weird basically. Um, it's absolutely fantastic and I completely adore the creators of this game. It's it's just awesome. Basically, the way that you play, these are Luminis, they each come in all different colours and sizes and forms, etc, and they all have special abilities. These guys here just move quite fast and stuff. And also you can do this. Yep, you can split into two teams. Uh, the two teams comes later in the game with puzzle solving, etc. Which is pretty damn actually fluid to work with. Even though, basically, I'm running this off an Xbox controller, and these are controlled by the left and right analog stick. And, you know, it's not that hard to control either one separately. It takes a bit of practice, but it's rewarding as hell. This game is awesome. Um, absolutely fantastic. And look, here's a bit of a sort of demonstration of what you can do. Split your team up, go do their own sort of thing. And that is a demonstration of a puzzle which you need two teams for bring that all back together. Basically, as I say, this game is only in pre-alpha at the moment, only in a demo stages and stuff, so don't be expecting too much, although this game delivers too much in a good extent. These are little enemy things. You drive into them like that and you hopefully don't die. Uh, I think I didn't die. Cool. Nope. I hope I didn't. So yeah, this game is really, really simple on the basis of the main mechanics of it. Oh, the main mechanics are... I'm not going to actually touch those in case they kill me. No, they don't seem to kill me. Okay, cool. There we go. Uh, yes, so basically it's so simple on the basis of that it's pretty much a puzzle and you just control two different t things like that. It's so awesome though. It doesn't need a massive amount of mechanics and stuff to work. You attack things by literally just riding into them on the non-aggressive side like these things here, red spikes. Don't walk into the red spikes, walk into their face, and they're dead. And then you can do this. Haha, -ha, we have taken you. <laughs> We're taking you to our master. I wonder if I can actually carry this as a team. Alright, team one, team two. Okay, we're going to carry this together. Okay, maybe not. Okay, we'll just leave that guy that. And yeah, basically, as you play through the game, you get various different colours of Luminis, each with their own ability. And as we'll see here, we should get some red ones, I think. I have played through this demo before, so I do know what I'm doing. Come on out. There we go. Aha, here we go. We have gained different colours. As you can see, LT basically changes formation. The ones at the front are the ones which will activate the abilities. So you get your red guys at the front, you use right trigger, and you activate their little shield ability sort of thing, which you can use to attack these here. Also, the game doesn't really tell you, it just shows you in little pictures, which is awesome. And as you see down there, it says, look, split around these monsters, sort of thing. And, yeah. Basically, this here is for stopping... Okay, there we go. Whoop, back together. Anyway, this here is for fighting these. You do that, and drive it into its face. And... Oh, okay, he's dead. <laughs> As you get along through this demo and stuff, they do get a lot harder and stuff to fight and stuff, but this is a start sort of thing, and it's fantastic. I cannot recommend this game enough. It's just too good. Oh, oh, oh crap, crap, crap. I got myself stuck under. There we go. Um, I keep forgetting the fact that you cannot see... Some actually cannot attack others. It's quite weird. They work in unique ways and stuff, so you got to sort of remember how you play... It's kind of cool, really. Up, oh, We nearly lost a Lumini. I have no idea if they are called a Lumini, by the way. I just thought I'd point that out. I'm guessing they're called a Lumini. We'll take this guy with us. He seems to be happy. He's coming along for the ride. Oh, yeah. Team 1. <laughs> oh, no. We lost him. This game is absolutely fantastic. It also has one of the best soundtracks that I have heard in recent games. It's so simple, but up. Oh, it's so bloody fantastic. Oh! I forgot about you guys. I just want my Lumini things. Leave me alone. Okay, okay, right. We'll leave those guys to it. 
So yeah, there isn't actually much that I can cover in this demo because I've pretty much covered all the workings of it already. You split up as teams, you work as teams to solve puzzles, it gets a bit more complicated as you play along, you gain little different new minis as you play along as well, and yeah. Oh, you find these big ones as well. Uh, also, you do have a limit on how many luminis you can have, seeing as, as you can see it's not dropping off any more crystals and that for bringing up more, more lumini. And as you just see there, it's telling me, look, I can do this. This game is recommended to play with a Xbox controller, and you know you can tell why because this would be uh, just the worst idea that you've ever had, ever. <laughs> To try and play this game without an Xbox controller, you are a bit silly, to be fair. And yeah, this this game, I just cannot say enough that it is fantastic. It's really, really fluid to work with. It just works so well. It just, it just seems, after playing this for a little while, just a couple of minutes or so, the mechanics and stuff just run so fluidly it's insane which is really really good in my opinion you know it's only a demo as I say so I can't really judge its gameplay too much but I, I, I'm judging its gameplay too much and it's just fantastic you know if they keep going at this basis this game is just gonna destroy the market so yeah, I'm going to end this here, because I don't want to ruin the entire demo for yourself, so you can probably go and get it down on all the links down below, which will be for the IndieDB website and stuff like that for them. So you can go contact them yourself, check it out, and see what you think of their trailers and stuff. So I've been the OG Nerd, this has been Lou Mini. it's an absolute pleasure to play, and I recommend you all to check this out. Until next time, I've been the OG Nerd, you guys have been awesome, ta -ra.